Good evening friends, I hope everyone is faring on well. This is Wendlin Mark again with another tutorial. In this tutorial I'll be illustrating to you how to use the OC auxiliary tools to update your Mac OS uh, that is OpenCore, Bootloader and the Kects. So I'll be using the OC auxiliary tools to do this task. The OC auxiliary tool is this tool here, OC auxiliary tools. If you don't know where to get this application, just check in the description, I'll provide a link to download it. First things first, I'll mount my EFI. Open volume and EFI or C folder. Then open your config.p list file with OCAT. Mine is uh, the default application, so I'll just double click. Here you see OCAT is open, so I'll just go to the this option here, this option, upgrade open core and cakes. So this option will allow me to upgrade open core and my cakes. So just click on it. Here it is, let me drag it in. So I'll, I'll go full screen so that you can see clearly. So any application that is red, if you see the red icon, that means there is an update available. Any cakes or any driver. On the right, the open core you can see are my drivers. Any driver that has red and any cakes that has red, that is the red symbol, means it has an update. For example, let me show you. You see uh, the first cake, that is the little cake. The current version is 1.6.8, but the installed one or the available one in my machine is 1.6.2. The same with virtual SMC cake. Uh, the current one is 1.6.2. 3.3 but in my machine I have 1.3.0 so all the cakes that are red are the ones that are to be updated so uh, the process here is quite simple first of all we need to ensure we are running the latest version of OpenCo just go to the right section and right click and choose latest version here yeah, choose latest version then click the get latest version of OpenCo then it will download that is complete as you can see it has automatically downloaded and updated here you can see the open core database has been successfully updated 1.0.2 so uh, that is done our bootloader now is up to date so we come to the next section which is updating our cakes so just click on the cakes that have red just four cakes then all the drivers here now once you've clicked uh, all the cakes that have the red uh, icons as i told you those are the ones that have updates available just for confirmation purposes you can also click check cakes for updates just so that you are sure that you've not missed it will run the database to check if there are any other cakes that needs to be updated as you can see there are other cakes that have been found so uh, we need to check all those that have been found so just uh, check with the check marks once you're done, click update cakes. I think everything is now well. I'll check again for updates. As you can see right now, uh, we have 1.6.9, 1.6.9. That means we are running the latest versions uh, that has completed. So uh, we, we are done with the cakes section. That is why I told you guys it is a very simple process. So just by checking the ones that had red and uh, clicking the update cakes, it has updated all the cakes. Once you're done with that, you'll come to this section and click start sync to sync all the changes you've made. You see it has successfully synced to OpenCore 1.0.2. Now click OK, then click Save. This version of OC Validate is only compatible with version 1.1.2. That is what we have just updated to. So right now, as you can see, if we go back to this section, that is the upgrade texts and OpenCore. If we go back here. As you can see, all the drivers are now updated. They are all green. They were red before, but they are now green. You can also check this other section. If you want again to confirm, just click check uh, cakes for updates. It will run the database again. See, it's still running. 
has completed running you can see all these uh, check boxes are green so that means everything is uh, up to date you can also see our drivers all of them are up to date so I'll just close I'll save my config.p list and that's it. By just partaking the processes we've done, we've managed to successfully update all our drivers, all our cakes, and everything including our bootloader is up to date. I'll just quit OC auxiliary tools. So we have successfully managed to update our cakes from uh, the older versions to the latest versions using OCAT. It is so simple. So that was a simple tutorial guys on how to update your cakes and your drivers. That is the open code drivers from the available versions to the current versions so i hope you enjoyed this video it is very direct it is not like open core configurator whereby you have to download the open core bootloader then you start replacing the files the oc auxiliary tools does this by itself and it is a very helpful utility that aids us quickly update our cakes and our bootloader and our drivers so i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, it was just a quick one to show you guys how i quickly update my cakes and to ensure everything is up to date so thank you so much guys for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one remember to stay safe signing out